Chaos isn't a pit. Chaos is a ladder. Yo, what is up guys? Welcome back to a brand new video and today we are actually going to be dissecting Season 8, Episode 5. And before this video starts, let's just watch that trailer. Okay, so the very first thing I want to talk about is right at the opening with Tyrion's walking up to Danny, and we get this shot right here. Tyrion walking past the giant dragon, and if this is not foreshadowing, then I don't know what is. This is foreshadowing something huge. Now, I don't know what it's going to be, but it had something obviously to do with the dragon because they wouldn't just show this shot of him walking past the dragon. But those are just my thoughts on it. And a bit later on in the preview, we see Cersei overlooking King's Landing, and we get this weird looking, like, creepy shot with the mountain in the back, his dark silhouette. It's it's very weird. It's very creepy. You could just see the smirk on her face. She's up to no good, obviously. Just, just pure evil. Now, I think that Cersei will die in this episode. They will take King's Landing here. It's going to be insane. Everything's going to be down to ashes. Cersei will fall here, and I'm pretty sure, mark my words, ladies and gentlemen, this scene right Right here when you see the mountain i think the fight is gonna break loose in that scene right there like you could just like imagine just seeing the mountain silhouette just drop because aria killed him or, or or the hounds getting to him something's gonna happen in that scene i think i'm not sure i could be wrong but i, I just have that feeling but nevertheless guys cersei will fall in this episode shortly after we get a scene with john with all his army he's preparing and they're right outside the gates of king's landing let me just tell you guys right here john and his team are terrible at battle planning look at this they're heavily outnumbered they're just facing the wall. There's like four scorpions on the top of those castles. If they attack right here, they're going to get shredded. I hope he's not just going to start the fight right there. I don't know how they expect this to work, but hopefully it's just another meeting. They're just going to talk again and then they're going to attack later on. I doubt it. They're going to attack right in this scene. With how it went in the Battle of Winterfell, they're probably just going to charge right into those gates. Who knows? Okay, and just quickly again, before I get into the main part of this video, there's a scene where Danny is with Tyrion, and you get a close-up of Tyrion. This scene is going to be very important. She's, I think right here, Tyrion is going to notice that she's not the same anymore. She's changed. She's going to go Mad Queen. This is when Tyrion realizes, you could tell by his facial expression, it's not going to be good, and he knows it. This is where I think he's also going to side with Varys more, and he's going to help uh, everyone tell the truth about John. Okay, now let's get to the main reason why I wanted to make this video and that is this scene where Euron just looks up into the sky and you get his shocked face after he and you, you hear this dragon sound. First of all, he looks like he saw a ghost. He definitely saw something and I'm going to break down these three things that I think he saw. Okay, so there's a scene in season 5 where Jorah and Tyrion are going through Valyria and you see Drogon flying by and the theory is that Drogon laid eggs there and those same eggs are grown because it's been a really long time. It's been years since that happened and those dragons are the same dragons flying over and that's why you see Euron freaking out because he realizes it's not just one dragon it's a whole lot more dragons I really like this theory I think it it's a hundred percent possible that she was just hiding it from everyone and I think we could see more dragons but these two next ones are I think what's mainly gonna happen I think these are way way more solid and that is that Drogon is flying over the clouds, way, 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 way up high. He's flying over the clouds, and he's going to go straight for King's Landing, right out of the Scorpion's sort of, like, reach, so the Scorpions won't be able to attack Drogon. 
and I think that he's Danny would just fly him straight to King's Landing and just start burning people. That right there is my favorite one. Uh, I think that's the one that's mainly gonna happen. But let's move on to a third one, and that is that Drogon is wearing armor. This is probably the most popular one. Drogon's wearing armor, and that's what freaks Euron out because he realizes that these arrows aren't gonna do anything and they're gonna die. All of these three are possible. I think the last two are probably the most possible. And out of all these three, one of them has to happen. I really can't see anything else happening. And pretty much, I just predicted this this next episode. Cersei will die, and King's Landing will be turned into ashes. Anyway, that's pretty much the video. I'll be posting way more videos about Season 8, Episode 4, and all, all the good Game of Thrones stuff. So if you don't want to miss out, make sure to leave a like again and subscribe. Thank you guys for watching. It's been Seagons. I'll see you guys in the next video. Goodbye.